Just released security footage capturing the horrific moments a nail salon tech is run over by a customer trying to flee from paying her bill. And tonight, police believe they've identified the woman who was driving. This is a prior booking photo of 21-year-old Crystal Whipple, who is now on the run and wanted for murder. Thanks for joining us here at 5 o'clock. I'm Denise Valdez. And I'm Sasha Loftus in for Brian tonight. This all happened on December 29th at the Crystal Nail Salon near Flamingo and Decatur. That's where 8 News Now reporter Karen Castro joins us live with the very latest on this investigation. Karen. Sasha and Denise, police now turning to the public for help finding 21-year-old Crystal Whipple, last seen leaving Crystal Nails four days ago. Take a good look at this mugshot. Whipple is wanted for the murder of a nail salon worker. Metro Police released surveillance video showing the moment Whipple reportedly leaves the nail salon, claiming she's going to get cash from her car after a fake credit card was denied. Investigators say when workers at the shop notice her attempting to drive off without paying for her nail services, 51-year-old Nock Wynn and her husband chased after her. Police say Whipple hit the gas and ran over Wynn, killing the mother of three. Police say Whipple was driving in a stolen vehicle that they later found at a nearby apartment complex, but there was no signs of Whipple. Court records show Whipple has a prior conviction for stealing a vehicle in 2016. Her known address at that time is about two miles from the nail salon. Wynn's daughters are in town from California helping out at their mother's shop. They did not want to speak with us on camera, saying they don't want to bring any more attention to the nail salon because the business has really been hurting since the incident, and they don't want to be the reason why other other workers don't get paid. And again, if you have any information on Whipple's whereabouts, you're urged to call police. Remember, you can report an anonymous tip to Crime Stoppers. Reporting live, Karen Castro, 8 News Now.